Hello, uh, my name is Alberto Quintana, and I am uh, usually your host when uh, you come in the groups of Be My Guest, which we enjoy so much. And we believe in, the, uh, in, in anything that has to do with sustainability. We have a garden, organic garden. And in this organic garden, which you will see in a minute, uh, we have all the products that can be produced in this area and others that we can adapt the conditions to produce here. With further ado, we will go and see the organic farm. I want to show you some of the animals that we produce here in our farm. This horse that you are seeing right now is a typical Costa Rican horse. Here is a, one of our pets, special pets, the Falabella horse called Bambi. His name is Bambi. Carmelo, a very special donkey. Uh, we also have a production of uh, goats where we milk them and, and sell the milk and, and use some of the milk. One of the purposes that we have in our farm is to try to produce healthy foods. I want to show you some of the some of the products. This is very interesting. It's a medicinal plant. It's very good for your sinus. The main product from Sarapiqui. Costa Rica is the number one exporter of pineapple in the world. We have a sample and it's the best pineapple you can find. Okay, this as you can see are pineapple plants. Very, very popular in Costa Rica. Couple tips in case that uh, that you want to, to see which is the best pineapple in the supermarket. Feel the crown of the pineapple. Like this one, you can see that it's really, really loose. So this is, pro is a good pineapple. If you go, for example, to this one, it is not ready, it is very, very strong. If you are not really sure that a pineapple is that, that good or that ready, uh, what I would recommend is to take it home, the pineapple, and put it backwards like this for a couple days. All the sugars, that are mainly concentrated on the bottom of the pineapple will run across the fruit, so it will make the whole fruit better. To plant a pineapple, uh, what I would recommend you is to cut the crown, like this one, like this, and then peel the bottom parts, like that. These are the roots of the plant. So it's really, really simple. You just peel them like that. Uh, if you have a pot, a big pot, um, just put some soil, regular soil. It, it is not that demanding of nutrients, so a regular soil uh, will do. And then just put it on the on the ground. Like this. We're going to plant one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, this is this is our house, and uh, this is the last stage during your visit. And so what we do here is uh, you can come. The first thing you will be received after this this heat and humid weather with a cocktail and then we will uh, serve you a, uh, a lunch based on all our products that we produce ourselves here organically. I just tell you that we will be uh, just waiting for you to come back and visit us. This is something that we enjoy very much and we hope that you will also enjoy. Thank you.